Yo, what is going on you guys? Blue Applehead here with another video and look, this is gonna be another day in a life video. Now, honestly, I wasn't even planning on picking up the camera and recording, but I was like, this is gonna, I have things to do today, so might as well pick up the camera and record something. There's this designer that I've been keeping up with, Heron Preston, and he's doing this collab thing where he's basically collabing with H&M and he's had this collection, hold up. TV is on. Let me turn it off real quick. It's remote. Yeah, but he's basically doing dropping this collection with H and M. It's like a collab that he's doing, and there's some pieces that I want to go check out, maybe pick up. And like I said, I just want to pick up the camera and bring you guys along, and also have other things. Why does every time I pick up the camera, they always gotta be doing uh, lawn, the doing the lawn and stuff like that? I swear, bro. But yeah, basically gonna be doing that. Then I got to be going to. And then I gotta be what then I'm going to the comic shop to pick up some comic books honestly not a lot because we are on a budget we're not gonna be spending as much as I would like but like I said we're not rich even if I was rich you gotta learn to manage your money not spend whatever you want and not just buy frivolous shit so that's what we're gonna do and yeah I'm just gonna bring you guys along now, like I said, I really wasn't even planning to do anything, but before I even head out, because it is kind of early, I do gotta clean up my room. So that's basically what we're gonna do. So first thing is I gotta fix this poster because it usually goes right there, but I had to take it down because it was starting to slide. Even this one, like if the corners are starting to slide off a little. so. I'm probably gonna have to fix this one too. And yeah, I'ma just do that real quick and then move on to the next thing. Yeah, dumb shit. I might let down Joker say cheese beats around my neck and that protect me for my haters who be hating. Don't you roll, call me in the night, but bro. So basically, I'm done cleaning my room. So, you know, why not show you guys a little room tour? Because I don't think I've really ever showed you guys what my room exactly looked like. I'm sure you guys get an idea of what it looks like, but why not just go through the whole thing real quick? So yeah, basically, I should do like a quick 180. But let's start with the setup. Now, like I said, setup. The setup literally hasn't changed for like three years. This is the PC. This is the monitor and keyboard and everything. Yeah, this hasn't changed in three years. So I'm not going to get to the specifics of everything. But yeah, this is just basic PC setup, studio setup, whatever. This is the journal. Now you can see that do a lot of journaling and this also doubles up as like sort of my film book I guess you could say where I just jot down like film ideas of like short films feature films that I want to end up doing I even have this Red Hood one this Red Hood concept that I'm working on and this one is a short film that I'm going to be working on soon so yeah basically set up you get the idea close you don't really need to see that. I don't know if this video is going to be coming after or before I do the pickup hauls, but this is just basically all the new clothes that I have. This has been here for a while. Like, I haven't changed it out because if I changed it, I would forget what clothes I bought because it's probably from like three months ago, honestly. Poster. You see? Chase nothing. Tracked everything. Wrote that because I am manifesting, directing a Miles Morales live action film for Sony in the future, so manifestation is key all my these aren't even all my favorite movies honestly but get the idea now this 
brown box. This is a short film that I actually filmed, but the thing is, but yeah, this is basically a poster that I wanted to, before I released the film on YouTube, I actually wanted to do this thing where I put in like a downloadable link code so you guys could print out this poster if you guys wanted to. But like I said, this is just a mock-up. This isn't the final design. So you can see it's not really like visible, the box, so I'm gonna have to brighten that up. And yeah, I'm gonna be working on that on Lightroom and um, Photoshop and everything like that. I already show you guys these posters. This is basically the mini fridge area. Nothing in there. Plants, couch. Now this couch, right now it's actually pretty dirty. I gotta clean that up in a minute. But yeah, this couch I actually got from Walmart. I got it on sale. Originally it was $200, but I got it for I believe $150. It was 250 original, I think I got it for 150, so super good steal. Comic book box. Now this isn't honestly filled. See, not really a lot. I have a lot of room. But yeah, this is just basically where I keep my Marvel comics. Don't worry about that. What else? TV, PS5 my movies and stuff like that this is another bookshelf this is where i also keep a lot of my comics this one is for dc comics honestly you see superman uh shazam wonder woman these are some of the books and where i keep where i keep my legos but yeah that's basically it for the main part now we can go into the closet area so yeah the closet area is pretty big honestly but <whistles> see i have this is where i keep all my pants close that up and this is where i keep all my tops like i said this is a, like essentially a walk-in closet but I have a lot of space in here that I really don't know what to do with it. So right now I just have this chair. Don't mind that, that's gonna be, I have to move that, pardon me. Have this chair, again, a little bit dirty. I have to clean that up, but that's just because I literally don't know what to do with this area. So I have that tripod. I put this thing here. I'm, I wanna put a poster here, but I feel like I have mad posters in my room, so that would be stupid. So yeah, quick. 60 of everything and the bathroom which you don't need to see basically i'm just gonna get ready to go out i what time is it it's 12 o'clock so yeah basically gonna be going out gonna be going to the mall i'm gonna go to h&m see if they have the stuff pick that stuff up if if it's suitable you know if it fits me if it looks good if i really do want it gonna buy that go to the comic sports blah, go to the comic book shop then pick up some food come home and then we'll go on from there all right so basically i think i know what fit i'm gonna wear i think i'm gonna wear now i think it's pretty hot outside but inside the mall you know it'd be cool so i think i'm gonna wear for the pants i'm gonna go with these now, if you know me, you know that I love these pants. These pants are like baggy um, carpenter pants, basically. So I love these pants. And you know the baggy wave is super big right now. I honestly want to get another one of these. I want to get a black one. I saw one that's black that doesn't have this double stitching on it. But I saw one that was black. I think I might pick that up. It's from the same brand, Dickies. So I'm going to be wearing that. Um, oh. For the shirt, I'm gonna go with this. This is another one of my favorite shirts. I haven't worn this in a while, honestly, because this is like, um, I don't know. I haven't worn this in a while, but I'm gonna throw this on. Now, I know in my last video I said I don't be wearing hoodies, but honestly, I have to throw this on. True Religion hoodie, regular zip up. For the bottoms, I actually 
crop them up a little bit. It's not really cropped, but it was just a little long. Now, I did it the getaway. You see, I put safety pins and attached it all along. So this is definitely a getaway of doing it. Do not do it the way that I did it, but yeah, I'm gonna throw this on. So yeah, this is essentially the fit. So, you know what I'm saying? All right. But yeah, I'm gonna be going to the mall, like I said, hold up. It is like super hot in this car right now. Oh wait, I actually wanna show you guys something. It is new glasses that I got. And sorry if my car is loud. I don't know if it's gonna pick up in the audio, but yeah, I got these new glasses. You can see it still has like the tag on it. You see, hold up. Where can I prop this up? God damn it. Uh, you know, we're gonna have to figure out. You know, I got something. Perfect. All right, so yeah, I got these new glasses right here. You can see. It's basically like my other ones, the black ones that I have, but gray. And you know, it's gonna go good with the fit cause you know, gray on gray, you know, do your homework. But yeah, these are, like I said, you can see, still see the tag. I'm gonna take these off real quick. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah, I'm looking like Soldier Boy. You know that picture of Soldier Boy with the chrome frame? So the, fuck it, we're gonna keep it like this. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Yeah. No, we don't do that anymore. Right now, I'm currently looking for it. I don't think they have it in stores, honestly. I talked to somebody and they said that it's mostly an online thing, but I literally just seen a video of somebody like literally going to the store and getting it. But yeah, so far, I'm not really seeing it. Damn, and I wanted those sweats too. Those sweats are fire. But yeah, just gonna keep looking around see what they have and then I'll let you know. So basically what I'm gonna do, oh, it's not the green, the lights are green. All right, relax. But yeah, basically what I'm gonna do is I'm actually gonna go to, I'm gonna drive there. Like I said, it's a 50 minute drive, but honestly, I it doesn't really matter. I'm making a big deal for no reason. It's Miami, it's Friday, might as well just go out not stay in the crib but yeah i'm gonna go turn. there i get it but yeah i'm gonna go there the comic shop i'm not gonna really do i'm not gonna really go to the comic shop anymore because i really don't need the comics that desperately so i can hold Make off on that turn. hold up but yeah i'm not gonna go to the comic book shop because that's a lot of driving and i really don't want to do all of that but <laughs> found it and this is actually the collection that they have sorry if the music is loud but yeah so they have the shirt this is what i really wanted the sweatpants i already got like a couple items but yeah let me just show you sweatpants really nice you can see that the stitching is actually on the outside comes with this lime green stitching on the inside very nice this is a shirt that I also picked up. I like how it has that kind of under layer to it, but it's all one piece. The hoodies I was actually thinking, but the hoodies are like way too thick. Honestly, like if you feel how thick this is, it's really like hefty. I was also thinking about the bombers too, but fam, I'm in Miami. Ain't no way I'm gonna get anywhere out of this. But this is basically the outside and this is the inside. But I would look so tough in this. Yeah, so I'm basically gonna try on the stuff that I have. Actually, before I do, let me get one more thing. Honestly, it fits pretty good. This is a medium. So, honestly, I wish it was a little bit shorter. But honestly, I think I might scoop this. 
I think this was the last one that they had. The other one that they had was a large. So for medium, not too bad. So this is the small. Honestly, literally, I think this is the same size. Like this fits, it says a small, but this literally fits like the medium, like this one. But yeah, looks good. The length is good. The arm length is good, I should say. This, like I said, I wish it was a little bit shorter, probably like up to here. But uh, like probably like up to here maybe. But honestly, not too bad. Honestly, for that streetwear look, this is kind of fire. I can't even lie. Uh, this is what the short, I said the shorts, the sweats look like on me. Honestly, yeah, these is fire. A little bit long, but I kind of like it like that. It kind of gives it that, like I said, that streetwear vibe. So kind of fucking with it. Okay, what the, what am I doing? Like I said, I don't know how well you guys are gonna be able to hear me because it's really loud, but yeah, picking up three things, not too much. Like I said, I only wanted to really buy the sweats, but I saw the shirt and I saw the black version. I was like, I gotta cop. Like those look too far for me to just pass up. So yeah, I'm gonna go check those out and then I'm gonna be on my way out of here. So I just got home. Why do I still got these on? So I just got home and look, I blew a bag, I ain't gonna lie, but look. I swear, every time I go out, I always gotta spend money, man. I gotta, I gotta chill on that. Nah, but honestly, it was worth, it's honestly worth it because the pieces that I picked up, I already showed you guys in the store, but yeah, these pieces are super fine. Now, one thing I wanna see is the sizing because I know for a fact one said medium and one said small, but they both fit the same. They feel, they, blah, blah, they fit good, but there's no way that one of them is small, medium, like they both have to be the same size. So I'm about to just do a quick examination of that real quick. Super, super unique design. I really love, like I said, it has this two layer thing where the it's actually one piece, it's like one clothing, but it has this thing where it's like sewed on the inside and it's like a short sleeve on top of a long sleeve. So it's very nice. You would think that something like this is heavy, like the material is very heavy but it's really not. And I like the way that, like I said, I like the way that they design it because it's not like a super heavy uh, material. Super nice. Of course, following the same design language with the flames on the side, you can see that's the white one, the black one. Again, same design language. It's just the black version. But this one fits really nice, like I said. I think that both of them are honestly, actually, not that I guess, not that they're side by side. Actually, no. Both of these have to be a small. Cause this is a, yeah, both of them. ain't no way. So that's basically going to be it for the vid. Ah, feels so good. Yeah, so that's basically gonna be it. I already showed you guys the clothes. I was gonna go to the comic book store, but like I said, driving, and traffic in Miami is just not it. Like traffic be super heavy at a certain time. And it's already like five o'clock, so I'm not trying to go back out again. But yeah, showed you guys the clothing. I'm gonna, like I said, in my next video is probably most likely going to be the clothing haul. So I'm gonna be showing you guys in depth of all of that, like the try-ons, different outfits I would wear with them, and then show you guys the rest of the clothing that I have behind the camera. And then just basically do that for the next video but yeah for the rest of the day i'm basically gonna be chilling like today's my day off i really got nothing to do um uh, probably just gonna lay down read a book finish my script like i said i have a lot to do in terms of my next short film so i have to get started on that and yeah basically i'm chilling for the rest of the day so hopefully you guys found this video entertaining like i said quick little vlog i don't even know how long this video is gonna be but right now i'm just chatting i don't i'm chatting i'll see you guys in the next video peace Thank you.